Our tale begins in the autumn of 1982 in the village of Brookhurst, England. It was here that the specter called the Ghost of Brookhurst became known. A cold, clammy mist enshrouded this small village just north of London as the twilight hours of Halloween night approached. For six days now, strange sounds and mysterious lights had been emanating from the forest surrounding the normally sleepy village. As darkness enveloped the countryside, once again the silver and gold lights appeared and the eerie sounds began, but with an intensity much greater than any other night. The villagers bravely combed the surrounding countryside, hoping to track down the source of the wild sounds and brilliant lights, but whenever it seemed they were within reach of the lights, they raced away, but always staying within the villagers' sight, as if waiting for them to catch up. Despite their growing fears, the townspeople were determined to catch whatever it was that appeared to be taunting them and continued to follow the unnatural display. As the midnight hour approached, the villagers found themselves being drawn closer and closer to an old abandoned mansion on the very outskirts of the village proper. The townspeople, whose numbers had swelled to almost a hundred, stood outside the huge broken-down manor, staring in amazement as the lights moved from window to window like an anxious child straining to see who had arrived to visit. One by one, the villagers filed into the mansion. Suddenly, the air grew thick. Despite the stillness of the October evening, the doors and window shutters began slamming violently. As quickly as it began, the wild thrashing stopped and a dead silence prevailed as the villagers sensed an unseen presence joining them, lurking in the shadows. Suddenly, from the corner of the huge entrance hall, a hazy light began to glow, growing in intensity with each passing moment. Within the glow, a shape began to form, and some of the villagers began to giggle nervously as they recognized the shape of a grandfather clock. Their giggles turned to gasps as the clock began to chime the midnight hour, and a whirling light appeared on the ceiling with a brightness so intense that the villagers were forced to shield their eyes. Within seconds, the light evolved into a creature like none had ever seen seen. It shimmered as it formed from crystals and had the face and body of a young child. The spell of wonder was broken as the visage streaked across the room and up a flight of stairs. Chaos erupted as the adults ran after it like children chasing fireflies. The sounds which had seemed so mysterious over the past few days became all too clear. It was laughter. The villagers began to realize they were being played with and they chased even harder after the shimmering image. Finally, the ghost swooped down and laughing with delight cried, Until next Halloween, my pets, and rose higher and higher into the night until it could not be distinguished from the evening stars. <laughs>